Okay, so I took those three bolts off, and just as I suspected, that's it. There's the radiator all by its lonesome. Now we gotta take it back to the parts store and trade it in. And hopefully they don't give me a hard time about it. Because if I didn't show you before, here's the reason the whole problem started. Right along here, you may not be able to see it because of the video, but I'll accent it later if I have the editing tools to do it, I'll show you. Right in here is a crack. And that crack, I'll push it a little bit, just enough to blow out a whole bunch of steam. And that's what caused the car to overheat in the first place, and that's why Vicky pulled over and called us to come help her. So, looks like this is a manufacturer's defect because there's no reason why that should have broke uh, from our error or the person who installed this is error. So, must have been something the manufacturer screwed up on, so they should be able to replace this. But anyways, now we're going to head out there and take care of that. Until then, 